Hey everybody, how y'all doing? This is Carla Wynix with today's inspiration. You know, I'm so excited about a picture that my brother shared with me. I have two brothers, Michael, who is older than I, five years older than I am, and Ira, who is five years younger than I am. We're the only siblings, the only three children of Michael and Laura Young Sr. And they're both deceased. But Ira found a picture from one of our old, uh, and well, the age isn't old, but from one of our friends from childhood, and, and not just childhood, but our parents, her mother and our mother, were very good friends since they were in uh, elementary school as children. And so Mama, you know, they stayed in touch all through um, um, their married life, all through adulthood. And uh, Marion is her name. She's still uh, living and she, you know, has her children. And they remember when we were all little, you know, and we played together and what have you. But there was a picture that one of the um, daughters had of mama and daddy, my mama and daddy. And boy, it brought back so many memories. I remember, I don't remember them taking a picture, but I remember that time. I remember the shirt daddy wore. And I remember mama, and they were standing there. Mama was so short. <laughs> and daddy had that, that striped shirt on. And I just, I just told Ira, I said, thank you for sharing that because, you know, it's just, that's, that's our, our fond memories. And that's when we lived in California. I just want to encourage all of you, if you have children, especially to make sure that you have, and you create fond memories for your children. You know, Tiffany argues with me when I take pictures and I want pictures of them and I want to document things and what have you. And she's like, why? Why so many pictures? Well, my mom was like that. She always kept pictures, took pictures, uh, had pictures of everything. And I think it's a good thing because it chrono chronicles, what's the word? It's a chronicle for your life. It documents and it does do it does what it did for me and Ira and Michael. It made us smile and it made us remember, you know, our parents have been gone and, and we just all that's all we have are memories. Our memories and they're good memories. Someone said um that every family is dysfunctional and every family had had bad times and hard times and difficult. I'm like, well, no, I don't remember nothing like that. Unless my brain has been washed, I don't remember anything bad about my childhood. I don't remember anything um, dysfunctional with us as as we as we were growing up. And now my brothers and I we're very close. We're extremely close. And I remember Mama, but Mama used to say things like, "You know, y'all better always stick together because you all you you're all you got." And that sticks with me. You know, we, it's true, This we're all we got. And both of them, Michael and Ira, they love my family. I love their family, well, Michael's family. And Ira, he's single, but he's a hardworking um, person. And he loves us dearly. I just cannot imagine anything less or anything different. You know, we're always going to be there for each other and look out for each other. They love me like a, a princess. They really do. And, and and they love my kids, and I love uh, Michael kids and his grandkids, and and that's my family. You know, we were raised like that, and I just hope that you create those kind of memories for your children as well. I try to do the same for mine. They might they might fuss at me, you know, but it, everything I do for them is with love, and they're gonna hopefully remember me in in a fond way and smile when they see my pictures or, sm or smile when they think about me and the way it is now be happy when they see my videos god bless you this is carla y Nix with today's inspiration